Uh, do you guys ever play uh, Winter Games for the Commodore 64? This is like a very, very old computer game. Uh, no. So Winter Games. It was it was an, uh, it, you guys might be too young. Woody might be too old for it. I'm in the sweet spot. But the uh, <laughs> the idea was basically so it's it's the Olympics. You know the the whole game was various different Olympic events, and one was figure skating. And if you fell enough times, you got a perfect score. It was I don't know if it was a purposeful glitch or just something wrong with the game. But if you fell the most number of times, you would get all tens. And like, or or per sixes, whatever the fuck the perfect score is in in skating, and uh, and so like there was uh, there were two ways to play. It was like try to do all the try to hit all the jumps, or try to fucking fall on your face. And I've uh, I've seen comics have sets like that, <laughs> like they fall so much that people are like, okay, I like this. Bill Burr in Philadelphia. Yeah, <laughs> no, Bill Burr in Philadelphia started started on the ice and then landed a fucking quadruple jump. <laughs> like that set was amazing. I just watched that a couple days ago. I've been watching this uh, this uh, YouTuber who like he watches. He's a black guy and he doesn't know much about like rock music or country music and a lot of other like genres. And so it's just him watching music videos to music that he has no no idea about. And uh, <laughs> it, it's it's actually really good to see his reaction to like some old country music or or some old rock or something. But uh, he 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 reacted to Bill Burr's set. Uh, in uh, in Philly, and it was fucking hilarious. I, I hadn't heard him do it in like years, so it was it had been a while since I'd seen it. And man, that was hilarious. It must be a I YouTube love- algorithm was- thing, because like that thing got put in front of me not long. Like, I've also watched it in the last week or two. Yeah, and uh, it was good. It was really good. I remembered. It, it was even better in my memory. Like, but it was really good. And uh, but what's cool is I saw Bill Burr talk about it and like how it worked and what the comp. How- it's it's exaggerated that like every comic before him was failing. It was really just one or two guys that struggled, and some guys were killing it. And uh, yeah, he just got up there and sort of went at the fans instead of trying to please them. He he went at them, and they liked it because Philly's awesome. There was a uh, there was a show I did at the Fringe in Edinburgh where I didn't really understand how the show worked. It was this late night show. It's called Late and Live, and it is notorious. Um, for just a really rowdy crowd. And so I went up there and like, you can't get them to listen at all. And finally there was, <laughs> there was some asshole who like, he was upset cause I was wearing uh, black shoes with blue jeans and he was like giving, trying to give me shit about it. And I was like, I don't care enough to be upset by this. <laughs> and he was just you know, this rich kid with a fucking, you know, pink shirt with like the collar half popped and like drinking wine at this mm. at this like, rowdy show is ridiculous so i asked him and i was just like uh i was like oh do you have i was like what kind of shoes do you have and he like holds one up to like show me i was like that looks like a nice shoe that's a nice shoe man and he's like yeah and he's like all proud of his nice shoes and i go can i see <laughs> that like all excited and he goes yeah and he tosses it to me and i turn and i just throw it off the stage to the side <laughs> and I walking home in the rain asshole and <laughs> i just did it because i was mad and like i couldn't get them on my side and i like i left the stage and the producer makes a beeline for me and i'm like well here it is i'm never gonna get booked on this show again and she just goes oh that was great and she gives me a hug i was like that's that's what you wanted from this show <laughs> oh it's been a while since you've been here but we call him johnny shoes he causes problems every <laughs> second <laughs> every <laughs> he has never approved of the comics footwear <laughs> yeah, she, booked, she booked me again the next week. <laughs> like, oh, cool. It was ridiculous, and I was just like, I just don't like that guy. That's why I did it. Uh, that's what, yeah, that's what, that's what 